Greetings and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Dungeons 2. Right, still spreading the corruption, still training up my demons. Well, training up is a big word. Keeping them alive for now. Especially at level 1 demons, you really only go out with the fire demons and the lust demons. Because the shadow demons and the fright demons are just too fragile to take to the surface. Especially considering I'm missing a couple of rather essential buildings that I can't currently get. But I really do need to get to the service, and since I'm generally just waiting for gold to be mined, it does seem to be a little bit more worthwhile my time to try and endeavor to get to the surface. So let's see if I can just get a little bit more. One more fire demon should do. And then I can leave my minions to do their evil biddings for now. And I do need to get more mana. Get more everything. improve whatever buildings I have. Might as well research that. I think at least the first level research is probably a good idea. And try to be as greedy as possible. The enemies will just be coming from that side, so it's something to be appraised of. Uh, just some spiders on the outside, that's not so bad. I really want the first level of this though. Move faster, you. All right. Encourage the servants. While at the very least, I'll build out the forge. I mean, the corruption is spreading, slowly, but it is spreading. Get some tentacle doors on the main building here. Just to make everything a little bit more efficient. Demons tend to be, take a while to get everything set up because everything is just slightly more expensive compared to monsters, it seems. But, uh, it's it, might, it might take a while to get set up in the early game, especially since you're reliant on getting fire demons there and lust demons to defend your yourself. Alright. You die. Right, let's set up our defenses. <laughs> this is just some quick experience. They didn't level. Well, pity. Alright, that should make the room a little bit more efficient. A lot more efficient, actually. 
Very good. My apologies, by the way, if you're hearing some ambient noise. It's quite hot today, and I'm having trouble keeping my room ventilated. So I've got the fan on, the door open, so we might have some ambient sounds. But it's either that or I'm watching my computer slowly melt. Alright, my minions are busy hacking away at stuff. And I'm pretty sure I just spent all my mana on getting rid of a bard. Which isn't helping, necessarily. Alright. I need a lot more mana before I can get anything done. Let's get this gold dug out. Because I can and because I need to. I might need a couple more admiration chambers set up since my rooms are a little bit spread out. Let's also create a pathway through here. Just to speed things along. Right, corruption is spreading nicely though, so that's good. Alright, let's make the shadow chamber a little bit bigger. There is a corridor. Alright. Servants are now encouraged, so they'll move somewhat faster. Good. Fill in the bank spaces over here since I don't want anything else. Don't have any spare eggs just yet. Right, let's have a little bit of an exploratory journey across the surface. While I'm waiting for mana and money to accumulate. Just a quick jaunt. I don't think I have quite enough units yet to take on a unicorn's or the tree of life. And I should be able to handle a spider. And getting my people leveled up is definitely a good idea. Well, I'm saying people. Let's not be in the range of those defenses. Come on, kill the fox. That hurt. Alright, well, I can't quite do anything while there's this wounded. Your dungeon is being attacked. Oh, oops. Got a bit ahead of myself there. Tension's all gone, don't worry. Everything's fine. You don't have to build any further defenses. Cute. Right. Keep getting things dug out. And that is right, right? Yeah. The one, two, three, four, uh, slightly too wide, but that's fine. Uh, it does need to be dug out this way, though. Payday. 
Alright, that's fine. We've got the monies. Alright, so let's make our... Let's make our uh, fire demons a little tougher. Enemies have entered the dungeon. And let's make our lost demons have a little bit more critical hit. I think I just overwrote the attack. Alright, we have got incoming of slightly tougher enemies and a bard. Well, brat. enough. Now just a bar to deal with. Alright. Well, the, the very least. We're continuing to work. Alright. Let's dig on through. Must keep ahead of whatever the enemy is doing. We still don't have enough peoples, but the research is coming along. Now I can't control, of course, where my demons will uh, take their pleasures, but at the very least they shouldn't be too silly about it. Uh, and having them close enough to wherever they work will definitely help speed things along. Right, uh, let's take care of that. Yeah, the best place to put some traps is probably over here. I don't have any traps at the moment. I do have enough eggs, but I don't have enough money, really. Stacking bigger gold piles. I'm not sure that helped me right away. Let's get better healing for the admiration chambers. Definitely will help, because that speeds everything up. Let me just keep digging. And there's another shadow chamber location over here. <laughs> Just merrily digging away. Get the hole built out. Yeah, that should at the very least make things a little bit more efficient. I mean, this hall is already 100% efficient and the corruption is spreading slowly. Hmm. Alright, are my fire demons healed up? Looks like they are. And they finished their task. So they are being a little bit bored, which is fine. Being a little bit bored is absolutely fine. And 
Right, I have more room for people. Let's get some more people. At least one more uh, mistress and one more uh, inferno. And then we can think about actually doing something positive on the surface. Well, positive for me. Stop being lazy. Because I really need an evil. Discovered a new area. There's just more gold to dig out. Alright. And let's get one more servant. And then we can start being proper evil. Payday! Rather than being the margarine of evil. And let's get bigger piles of gold so they won't have to travel too far. And we have plenty of uh, things now, so let's get that research done. Alright, I really should investigate in the... Uh, or uh, invest, rather. Investigate in the torture chamber so I can give my minions something a little bit more uh, to do, rather for fun. Because they do have fun to be pleasured. Because the admiration uh, team takes care of their uh, food needs, but they uh, they are bored out of their minds. All right, demonic weapons. That is nice. Let's make them a little bit tougher before I go out. I mean, I kind of like the invisible lurkers uh, ability as well, which makes my shadow lurkers invisible for as long as they don't take any damage. Which is indeed quite useful, because it means they can attack from shadows. And then at this point in time there is... Yeah, there aren't many enemies that can actually see through uh, invisibility, so... This would actually be somewhat useful. Spiders have spread throughout the underground. Oh, for crying out. Oh, well, it's just a small nest. That is fine. Let's deal with the heroes here first. Alright, so my fire demons are a little bit tougher. I uh, might as well make them a little bit more armored. Making the mistresses more tough is nice, but not crucial. And I don't really care about uh, investing in the... Uh, what is it? Fright demons? Because at the moment I only get the exploding infested. Which is not really a good deal for me. Because I really kind of want my minions to not die. <laughs> not because it's so terribly uh, inefficient. cheap let's do it because now I need to wait again until they're fully healed before I can go outside otherwise the whole thing is wasted especially since I'm still waiting for the spell to be researched well the game at least keeps you busy but again the demons have a very slow start in my opinion and it doesn't get much better later on I mean you do start steamrolling a little bit easier once you get up to the second level of evil but uh, it still takes a while to upgrade your demons for different reasons. Since it's a bit more of an investment than with the monsters. Now, probably for good reasons, because the demons are slightly overpowered, perhaps. Since they are so very easy to uh, revive. After all, you only really need to drop them onto one of these admiration things and... Uh, they are just peachy keen. 
But in any case, that'll have to be the end of this episode. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.